box was ripped. They did me wrong. They did me so, so wrong. Hello beautiful besties, welcome back to another video. If this is your first time watching, I'm Sheree, welcome. If you happen to be returning, you are truly appreciated. Thank you so much and welcome back besties. You guys, I have a couple of things that I picked up in Miami. If you watched that vlog, I'm gonna share with you what I picked up. Thank you so much to everybody on Instagram because I was DMing you guys and chatting with you back and forth and taking polls and asking you which one do you think, which one do you think? Well, this is the video. I'll be sharing with you everything that we conversated about, converse, conversated, whatever, everything that we chatted about in the comment section over in the DM section on Instagram. We are going to share with you right now what we picked up. Here on this channel, I do cover fashion, beauty, luxury, lifestyle, all things, okay? All things. Fancy and fabulous dwelling. So if that sounds like something that you'd be into or you want to be a part of, stop what you're doing. I want to hear from you today. Drop me. What are you rocking? What is your scent of the day? If this seems like your vibe or just go ahead and consider hitting the subscribe button. Turn on your post notification bells. That way you never miss a video over here. And like I said, if you really want to become a bestie come over and slide in the dm and say hey girl how you doing i was at dior and you guys know that i love dior i've become a dior girl yes i have i am currently more of a dior girl than i am a chanel girl at the moment at the moment because i don't know dior has just been doing it for me you know how all of a sudden you're like oh my god where have you been my whole life the packaging that dior has right now is so super cute look at this how cute is this? If you're a packaging person, I mean, not everybody's a packaging person. I'm a packaging girl. So I love cute, cute packaging. You guys, these are some earrings I shared with you. Remember I was telling you that I was gonna check out the earrings and see if I wanted to get the earrings or if I wanted to get that ring. And I got the earrings because I love these. I'm a stud kind of girl. I like a smaller earring. I know you can tell today. <laughs> today she's being very fancy, darling, but I love a stud earring. So these are the ones that I picked up. They just say CD. They're super, super cute. I love them. They're a stud. Very cute, very classic, especially now that I've been wearing my hair back. I just love like a really simple stud. I think it just elevates the look and you know, I don't have to worry about it dangling. So I did pick those up. I also picked up these ones from Fendi. I don't know if I shared these with you on Instagram or not, but yeah, this is what the box looks like. I had my eyes on these for a while, not these ones uh, particularly because these ones were newer. Oh my, maybe I should wear these today. Oh yes, but I love these. Let me show you these. These are what these look like. They just have the FF on them and one of it has crystal and one of it is just regular. So I did pick these up as well and I love these. Okay, now let me give you a quick 2.5 story time. So we were coming through TSA at the airport, uh, Fort Lauderdale, Miami, I believe. You guys, I could be making that all, all that up, but nevertheless, we were coming through the airport and what's my time? Oh my God, I gotta hurry up, okay? So we were coming through the airport. My bags were bagging, they were big. So yes, the bags were fairly big. We knew this, right? So we were coming through, the guy made us really mad. It was, it could have been a real, real bad situation, but you know, my guy and I were both like, Ugh. Let's be chill, let's be chill because we gotta get out of here. We don't know, we don't know the rules and everything over here. So let's be real chill. So we went and checked another bag that I have to call TSA about because it was horrible. It was a horrible experience. We didn't even have, you're supposed to be able to take a carry-on and another bag, right? That's what we had, but he was counting a suit coat as a bag. Whatever, we're not here to talk about that. I don't need to even go there. So anyway, so I'm carrying everything through. I had my bags, that was fine. I did not want to check these. I was not gonna check, you know, my handbags. That's just not what we do. We don't check those type of bags. I check clothes, I'll check everything else, but I'm not checking like my little suitcase because I normally have all of my stuff stuff, if you know, you know, in that one. And then the clothes, they can go. You know, they have air tags. I'll find them when I find them, but not my other, you know, luggage. That I gotta keep with me. So anyhow, I'm like, I'm carrying these bags through. I gotta carry them through. These are the size of the bags, okay? You can see, okay, so yeah, it's a pretty large size bag. It is. I had two because I have this one. You guys, this is what TSA did to the bag. Can you see this? This is what they did. It was, it was, it was perfect. It was beautiful. I wanted to bring it back and do an unboxing. That didn't happen because they ruined it. So I was sharing those with you to let you know I had you, I had the unboxing, the beautiful thing and everything, and then it was ruined. They took it through for the first time and it came out okay. And they were like, okay. And then the guy was like, and the girl, thank you so much. She was like, oh, I got you, I got you. She ran it through. She was like, no, it's good, it's good. And the guy was like, no, we gotta run it through again. She was like, why? It's good, I've already checked it. He was like, I don't care. We gotta run it through again. So they took it through again and just made a really bad situation. They broke the entire box. They they ruined the whole thing. I'm gonna check the bag and make sure nothing's wrong with it. I looked at it, you know, to make sure nothing was wrong with it and it wasn't, but I'm gonna check it again, you know. They made me unbox 
all of the packaging and all of the paper off. The box is dirty. It's no longer beautiful for a keepsake or anything like that, but this was a box that it did have. It had a beautiful bowl. Dior had did it and fancied it up and made it beautiful. I had a beautiful experience shopping, beautiful time. I mean, the client advisor, the client essay, whatever you choose to call them was absolutely amazing. The customer service, phenomenal, top notch, every single thing, amazing experience. It was not the Dior. It was just at TSA at the airport where this went down and it was horrible. So anyhow, um, back to why we're here. <laughs> Let me, oh, give this piece of advice too. You may have known this. I didn't know this. My guy said that he was going to tell me to do this, but then I have such trust issues. It probably would have been hard for me to do. If I ever shop with stuff like this, I'm just going to have it shipped to my home. I won't even bring it through the airport, anything like that. I'm just going to have it shipped in my home to my home. And if it's not to my liking, I will take it to my local Dior or Fendi or whatever store. And I will make the adjustments there. So that's just a tip. Have it shipped. Don't even bother with it. So you guys know, I'll insert a clip of the ones that I would have got. This is the one that I got. It's not the one you guys thought. I went with the classic one because I'm a classic girl. You guys, the butterfly one was super cute, but it would have been super Super cute for spring summer but I want to be able to carry it year round so I went with this one and this is a new print by Christian Dior and it's montage and montane it has all the different places it has Paris on there and you know I talk to you about Paris all the time because when we went there I stayed on this street it was a beautiful experience and I wanted a tote bag to put my computer and all my different stuff in when I'm traveling I just wanted to up it a little bit and this is so me you know look hello look at me you guys hello Hello, look at me today. So that's what I'm saying. I live in black and white. I live in a pop of color every now and again. So this is gonna get so much use. It just is so me. It's so classic, it's so timeless, it's elevated, it's elegant. I love it. I absolutely love it. So yes, this is what I went with. I do want something from the other print, but this is the one that I went with. If you look on here, it has Champs Elise, it has 31 Rue Cabone, it just has all the different places in Paris on there. I love this. It is so gorgeous. Okay, so I did go with this one but thank you everyone for your help the other box look this is the other box i didn't do this this happened through tsa just look it's ripped the whole box was ripped they did me wrong they did me so so wrong thank god it's a box and if i wanted to go get a box fendi was like you know we'll give you another box you can just go to the fendi in los angeles beverly hills and you can get another box i don't need a box it wasn't about the box it was just the principle of it the top of the box is not supposed to come off you guys so this is the bag that i did get now listen 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 i know i know the other bag, I'll pop a picture of it. The other bag, I really wanted to get. I really loved that bag. It was different. It was it was classy. It was luxurious. It stood out. It was different. It was unique. It was a cool gray, or maybe like a taupe, I would say. I don't really know, like a creamy, cool gray kind of taupe. But then the other one was kind of like a camel color. And yes, it's the more popular of the two. And yes, more people have that. I always tell you guys, I don't care what nobody else have. I really don't care. The whole world can rock it. I'm gonna always rock it different and set it apart because I'm Sheree. I do things my way and I don't care if 5,100 people have it, I'ma still have it because I want it. So we just all got good taste. Hey girl, hey guy, we all got good taste. But anyways, this is the one I went with because for my clothing choice, this is gonna go better. This went better with black, it went better with cream, it went better with nude, it went better. This is the one that I went with. It's absolutely gorgeous. You guys, this is so big. I did not know it was like this big. I mean, I did, but it didn't feel this big in store, but you know, I carry little tiny bags, like the little mini Lady Dior, and the little, you know, Chanel bags. Like all my bags are little. And every time I was going somewhere, I was trying to put the stuff in the bag and it never could fit in because my bags were too small. So I wanted to get something for when I'm going places, I'm traveling, I'm doing different things. I have a bigger bag. Yes, I love my Neverfull, but I've been traveling with it so long. I would say like 10 years now. It was time for something new. I have my eye on Goat Yard, what I might still just get a little something from there. As like a, a, a duffel bag or something, but something a little bit more dressier and a little bit more refined. I wanted to get this. I know the logo is there. I've never been like a girl that's like, oh, I don't want it to really be logo. It could be logo. It, it's a logo, it is what it is. I like it. So yeah, so I went with this one. It has the um, the handles that look like this. I forgot what they told me the name of this was called, darn. Um, oh God, I forgot. But I have two more bags like this that are the smaller ones. So I have one that's kind of like a cream topi of the other one. And I have a pink one that they did with Fondanti, they did with Versace. And then I have this one. So 
it was unnecessary for me to get the other one, but I do love this one. So this is the one that I went with and I absolutely love it. And it goes so good with black. I mean, and it goes so good with like my skin tone and my whole like vibe like of everything. Like I love it. So yes, I did go with this one. And this is what I'm talking about. When I buy bags, you guys, I want everything to be covered. I want this to be plastic, the handle to be plastic. I don't want nothing to be taken off. It does come with a strap too which is kind of nice. And they did have another strap that you could get. I don't know if I'll wear the strap. I guess maybe if I'm traveling, I'll probably put the strap on. I mean, I don't know really how I'm gonna wear it quite yet, but I know when I'm carrying my suitcase, I'll definitely have to put the, I'll have to put the strap on. But yeah, this is it here. That was my experience. That was my experience at TSA. Like you guys need to do better. You need to be nicer. You need to be kinder. You need to be respectful of people's items that they purchased and you know, just be nicer. If you would have had something nice to say, like, oh, let me help you. Maybe you could do this. Maybe you could do that. Suggest things. Talk to people, not at people. Hopefully somebody from TSA is watching. And to all the girls at the front that we exchanged all the things, because you guys, they were so nice. They were like, oh, we're going to follow you. We're going to watch the channel. Thank you, girls. To all the women there, thank you so much. But some of the people were just rude. So I just wanted to be out there and to be known. That's my TED Talk for today. You guys, if you are out and you're shopping, like I said, you might know this. I don't know why I didn't think of this my own self, so I'm talking to myself. Next time, just have your stuff shipped to your house. That way you don't have to deal with broke boxes, dirty boxes, no packaging, ruined experiences, what have you. Nevertheless, I'm happy I got my items. Thank you guys so much for taking the time to stop by my channel today. I truly appreciate you. I love you like I love cooked food. I will talk to you all in the next one. Until next time, you know the drill. Be blessed, stay fit, and definitely stay fabulous, dwellings. Thanks for watching. Bye.